Thorena as Christensen was a Danish-American serial killer from Solvang, California. He committed his first three murders in late 1976 and early 1977, killing young women of similar appearance from Isla Vista, California. His crimes motivated large demonstrations opposed to violence against women and in favor of better transportation for the young people residing in Isla Vista. In 1979, he killed a young African-American woman from Los Angeles. A fifth intended victim escaped with a bullet in her head, and later identified him in a Los Angeles bar. Early Life He was born in Denmark, and immigrated to Inglewood. California with his parents and on to Solvang when he was five years old. His father, Enis, ran a restaurant in Solvang. He was a good student until his junior year when he began neglecting his schoolwork. He moved out of his parents' house, dropped out of high school, and began working as a gas station attendant. During this time he gained a great deal of weight, at one point weighing 275 pounds. Murders Christensen was obsessed with fantasies of shooting women and having sex with their corpses. He stole a 22 caliber pistol from a friend and committed his first three murders. He then moved to Oregon, lost weight, and moved back to Santa Barbara County to complete his high school diploma at a junior college. He moved into an apartment in Goleta with a woman in her 20s. They met while she was hitchhiking. Although several young women had disappeared from Isla Vista in late 1976, Christensen's first confirmed victim was Patricia Marie Laney, who disappeared January 18, 1977. The next day, her body was found on an isolated road in Refugio Canyon, in the Santa Yanis Mountains northwest of Isla Vista near Rancho del Cielo. Victims Jacqueline Ann Rook, B. Jan. 12, 1955, November, 20, 1976, aged 21, Isla Vista, originally from Del Mar, born in Chicago. Mary Ann Saris, B. June 24, 1957, December 6, 1976, aged 19, Isla Vista, originally from Santa Rosa. Patricia Marie Laney, B. Sep. 15, 1955, Jan. 18, 1977, aged 21, Isla Vista, originally from Whittier, though her parents had relocated to Huntington Beach by the time of her death. Capture Lydia Preston met Christensen again on July 11, 1979 in the Bottom Line Bar in Hollywood, and reported him to police who promptly arrested him, because of Christensen's address in Goleta, California and the similarity of Preston's ordeal to evidence police had collected in the Rook, Saris, and Laney cases. Christensen became a suspect in the East La Vista murders. After his arrest, Santa Barbara County law enforcement realized they had investigated him as a suspect, among approximately 100 others. In 1977, they noted his possession of a 22 caliber pistol during an earlier arrest for minor in possession of alcohol. Trial Christensen was first tried in early 1980 in Santa Monica for the murder of Laura Sue Benjamin. He initially pleaded insanity, but he withdrew the plea. Death On March 30, 1981, Christensen died from a single stab wound in the chest in the exercise yard at Folsom State Prison. Aftermath Patricia Laney has become a prominent symbol for groups that advocate against violence to women in the Santa Barbara, Goleta, Isla Vista area. She had been a community volunteer with organizations that advocated against violence to women. The Isla Vista Juggling Festival which had its 38th meeting in 2014, was dedicated to her commencing in 1977.